Hello everyone. Let us see past perfect tense today. Now, in this tense, we are going to see sentences, the negative sentences, and questions. Now, a question comes in our mind. When do we use this past perfect tense? Now, see, this tense speaks about the past in the past. It shows the first action in the past before the second action happened. See, before we start some sentences, let us see subject first. Subjects are of three types, which is divided into two parts. First person, the person who speaks. In first person, singular is I and plural is we. Then comes second person. Now what is second person? The second person means what? The person to whom we are speaking to is known as second person in singular you and plural also you. Now in singular you it stands for one person and plural you stands for more than one person. Understood? Then comes third person. Now what is third person? The person to whom we are talking about is known as third person. Singular it's he, she, it and Sam. You can take another name instead of Sam and in plural it comes they. Now let us jump to the formula of past perfect tense. Now we have take a look, took a look at the subject. Now we know the subject then comes to be. Now what is to be? This to be means what? Helping verb is known as to be. Now in this past perfect tense we are going to use helping verb a model auxiliary verb as a had. Understood? Then then comes the third form of the verb. Understood? This third form of the verb is known as a past participle form. This third form of the verb is also known as past participle form of the verb. Then comes object. Understood? See example for this. If I will start my sentence with they, then it would be sound like they had gone to school. Means you are telling about a past action which was happened. Okay? Understood? See some example for this. For example, I had played football. You had played football. We had played football. They had played football. He had played football. She had played football. Sam had played football. Understood? See, uh, some negative sentence in past perfect tense. Uh, now, what I have done here, I have written the same formula which I use for past perfect tense. Subject plus to be plus verb 3 plus object. Now, exactly after to be means exactly after helping verb means exactly after a model auxiliary verb means this had. What we are going to do? We are going to add not exactly after this had. And that sentence becomes a negative sentence. Isn't that simple? The remaining part will remain as it is. Understood? See some example for this. Uh, I'll start my sentence with Sam. Sam had not played football. Means Sam had not done that activity. Understood? See, I'll make sentence Sam hadn't played football. This sentence, this had not or this hadn't are same. Hadn't is a short form of had not. Do you get it? See, I will transfer some sentences into negative sentences so to get it much better. For example, I had played football. Take a look at here. I have written this sentence. I had played football as it is here. I had played football. But what I have done a small change. I had not exactly after had and that sentence becomes a negative sentence. You have to keep this in mind. What we have to do is exactly after had we are going to use not and that sentence becomes a negative sentence in past perfect tense. Understood? See another example. You had played football. You had not played football. We had played football. We had not played football. They had played football. They had not played football. He had played football. He had not played football. She had played football. She had not played football. Sam had played football. Sam had not played football. Let us see negative sentences where we are going to use its short forms. We will directly jump to the sentences so you will get, you will understand it much better. For example, I had played football. Similarly, this sentence, the 
the underlined part will remain as it is in negative sentence. See, I here also I played football, here also played football. Now, this had, I'm going to make it negative sentence. So, what I have to do is had not. I'm, I should have used this had not, but I'm going to use its short form. So, it would become hadn't. So, I hadn't played football. Understood? See another example for this. You had played football. You hadn't played football. We had played football. We hadn't played football. They had played football. They hadn't played football. He had played football. He hadn't played football. She had played football. She hadn't played football. Sam had played football. Sam hadn't played football. Understood? Now, we'll make some questions in past perfect tense. I'll write first formula of past perfect tense. Uh, have I written the correct formula? There's something change in that. So what's what sort of change I have done here? See, what I've done, I changed the place of subject and to be. Interchange. I interchange their places. Subject come at the place of to be and to be came at the place of subject. And that sentence becomes a question. So is that simple? To change their places of two words and that sentence becomes a question. Wow, is that so simple? See some example. We'll directly jump to the example. I had played football. Now see, I had played football. Now look at this position, their position. I is at the first position and had is at the second position. Now in question, had comes at the first position and I go at the second position. And that sentence becomes a question. Isn't that simple? So the it's round like this. I had played football. Had I played football? Understood? See another example for this. You had played football. Had you played football? We had played football. Had we played football? They had played football. Had they played football? He had played football. Had he played football? She had played football. Had she played football? Sam had played football. Had Sam played football? Understood? Thanks for watching my video. Please subscribe and like the video. Thank you very much.